Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I know I always start it in bed, but I am not moving out of this bed anymore. It's currently uh, just after half one. And so far today, I have already done like 20,000 steps. And when I say that, I mean that. So hold on, what's it gonna tell me? I've done 19,921 steps. I didn't intend to do that many. I expected to do about 10,000, maybe 12, you know. I had to go get a lateral flow test at college today, so I went, I walked there, I left about 8 o'clock-ish, then when I was three quarters of the way there, it takes me an hour to get there by the way, I realised that I'd forgotten the two barcode, or the barcode stickers so I had to walk all the way back but then I realised I'm not going to be able to get to my original time in time so I had to cancel my original time luckily I could get in for 11 in the time slot of like 11 till 12 so obviously I walk home to get the stickers and then I walk all the way back to college to do the test luckily I tested negative because obviously you get the te text test and text are similar in a way and I could not walk home the I could not walk the hour home especially as it's uphill as well so I got the bus for £2.70 but I have made myself a massive pasta salad there isn't any salad cream because we ran out of salad cream but I don't care I made a massive bowl of pasta salad and I've just got my some bites. I also, when I was out, I bought a drink because my thought was, is that if my test did come back positive, I wouldn't be able to, I might not be able to get like a drink in from the shop in time to drink on my way home. So I bought... I went to popped into B and M on my second way. Let you know how after I'd come back to get the stickers, and I bought some Fanta lemon, and I don't care about the fact that it's like, you know, like the full fat one, where it's like, it's like a hundred calories for the thing. I don't care. Today I've burnt so many. I think I'm allowed to treat myself, which is also why I bought myself some sweets. They're not in my bag there are my pockets i also bought when i can actually find the pocket that they're in i let's get the sweets out first i bought some haribo fruity delicious can't go wrong with haribos and yeah and i also bought some oral b 3d white like toothbrush heads like replacement heads because um like, you're only supposed to use a toothbrush head for about three months before you replace it. So, I got some of these and I got them for £12. They should have been 17 So, good price. But yeah, I just popped into Wilco to get them and that was it. I also got, like, you know, like a new barcode thing for my second test. Because that was my first ever, like, test. So I'll probably get my second test like before my first lesson Monday. So yeah. Everything is awesome but I'm staying in bed. I'm gonna have to do assignments but I'm staying in bed. Like there is no way I am doing any more walking. Like if they think I'm gonna go to the shop they have another thing coming. Because I will have walked more steps than they have. My mum will only do like 5,000 maybe, maybe 7,000, I don't know. My stepdad might have done about the same. I beat that. So, I am not walking anywhere else, apart from downstairs to like eat, you know, or maybe to get like a drink, but uh, yeah. So I will catch you guys a little later. I'm sorry if feet gross you out. I'm also currently trying to like track my calories using the 
Fitbit app because I want to kind of see keep in line with range now on Friday we are having takeout you know like takeaway delivery you know and it's going to be like pizza or something like that type of vibe like pizza kebab like a kebab shop that sells pizza type thing so I was trying to eat track my what I was eating to make sure that I was like eat it because I do want I do need to lose weight anyway because obviously lockdown like lockdown weight you put on like I put on like a stone so I am trying to lose that but I'm also because we're having takeout I want to track it to make sure that I'm eating healthy and also because I've only just this week switched to pasta salads I wanted to see like what I was kind of consuming and that's also a good thing with the sweets like I will eat those sweets today like the whole packet but I think I'll still be in like a calorie deficit like I'm not restricting myself because I'm still gonna have like some Ben and Jerry's like cookie dough ice cream tonight but it's still in my calorie limit and I'm not starving myself or anything and so that's a good thing because you don't want to starve yourself Typically at breakfast I don't have Cocoa Pops because I had Cocoa Pops today but typically I have a banana but I didn't have a banana so it kind of balances out. However even if I had both it still wouldn't matter and yeah I just try and make sure I eat within but if let's say one day I go slightly like over budget I'm fine with it because I know that the other days I've been under and so I know it's not as big of a deal and I'm just trying to yeah eat healthier and by tracking my calories it kind of keeps me accountable like even though yes I think it was Friday I ate I ate a whole packet of squashies in like one hour and I was slightly over budget I just didn't care because I'd been eating clean and healthier the rest of the week if that makes sense so yeah I'm not trying to promote like being in like a really large calorie deficit but on days where I go for like longer walks I'm bound to be more of a calorie deficit because I'm not like okay yeah I'll probably eat like a little bit more pasta than usual or I might add like an extra slice of ham or something on those days I eat typically quite normal. I probably had like a little extra pasta today, but I'm eating normal. This is, yeah, and I'm making sure I've got all my food groups in there. Well, I think there's all the food groups in mine, but I don't know. Yeah, basically I'm pretty much, I'm eating like a balanced diet. Not diet, I don't like I don't like the word diet, it's quite negative. I'm eating like a balanced lifestyle in terms of that. I don't typically walk that many steps. Typically I do between two and three thousand a day, but that's because I'm at home. My step count overall will increase every other week whenever I'm back at college. So like next week, my step count for the week will be higher because I've got college. Monday and Wednesday or at least in person college on Monday and Wednesday and then remote on Friday so I try and keep things into good play but also Monday I am like my friends and I we've already decided that we're gonna go donuts or at least myself and another friend have and I'm pretty sure the other two will be like yeah we're going donuts so I've got that and then I know like not the week after that but because obviously it's every other week so like in three weeks time like two and a half weeks time on the Monday we'll go McDonald's because we've not been McDonald's all together for a long while so we'll treat ourselves just for like this first time and so yeah I'm not restricting myself in any way but I am trying to like make sure I eat cleaner other days if that makes sense okay so I never actually finished that there isn't even any footage of me like trying to continue it but 
firstly I'd like to point out we never actually went donuts I have had a McDonald's though and yeah I'm not trying to promote like unhealthy eating at all I'm just sort of saying like what I'm trying to do that's still trying to be healthy both mentally and physically but I hope you guys enjoyed the video I'd like to point out lateral flow tests aren't as bad as people make out like okay yeah you, you gag a little it's fine yeah your nose hurts a little bit and you sneeze after you take the swab out but honestly it's all right i now have to do it myself so there's that but i hope you guys enjoyed if you did don't forget to smash a massive thumbs up hit that subscribe button down below let me know in the comment section of any videos you want to see from me uni related if you want me to do like a little talk related to like covid like vaccine or if you want me to do like an update on my mental health and how my mental health is being let me know and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys